Now keeping you and your family safe. This is Two Works For You Weather, certified most accurate. Well, if you weren't out early this morning, then you missed mm -hmm. it. It was uh, pretty chilly out there, but... <laughs> it was kind of cold, yeah. The sun came out, and it's warming mm -hmm. up nicely. We're doing fairly well for now. Mm -hmm. This morning, these temperatures probably don't look like April. We had some 30s outside of Tulsa. Here are the morning lows we saw, Dina and Justin. What do you think? Uh, I think it's a little cold, but uh, we, <laughs> we were inside, so we can't That's complain. True. I think it's kind of a nice change. Mm -hmm. it, seems, it sort of seems like we went from winter to summer, mm -hmm. so good yeah. to have some spring weather. And, we, and let, let's appreciate these temperatures while we have them, because, yeah, we know mm -hmm. we're going to be into summertime pretty soon. Mid-30s across a bunch of uh, locations in green country, generally cooler to the north of Tulsa. Bartlesville was 36 this morning. Here's how the rest of the day is shaped up. Not much wind, a light north wind, beautiful blue sky, and temperatures warming up. 67 at 3 p.m. and 70 by 5. Right now we're at 59 degrees, but already feels warmer out there with the sunshine and light wind, and we have a north wind at 5 miles an hour. Around the rest of green country, mostly upper 50s and lower 60s. Bartlesville 61, 62 in Bristow, Okmulgee and McAllister in the lower 60s. Temperatures will be cooler today northeast of Tulsa as there is somewhat more cool air to the northeast. So toward Joplin, Grove, Pryor and Venita, temperatures are running a few degrees cooler. North wind across green country near five miles an hour, and that's about all the wind that we're going to get today, only at five to ten miles an hour. Across Oklahoma today, lots of sunshine showing up across the region, a few areas of clouds and a few small showers out toward West Texas. We have this cool area of high pressure nearby, and whenever you have an area of high pressure nearby, the wind is generally fairly light, and that's what we're seeing today. Now, for tomorrow, this high is going to move off to the east, and we will see a southwest wind returning. A southwest wind is a warm and dry wind. This means we'll see a warming trend. In fact, by tomorrow, we'll see highs, which could be reaching the mid-80s right here in green country. So much warmer weather for Tuesday. For the rest of today, rather uneventful, not showing any large areas of rain anywhere near Oklahoma, and at the most, some high clouds will be possible. We'll say a sunny to mostly sunny day for today. One thing you'll notice in the morning is that the wind will start to pick up. Tuesday morning, we'll have a south wind, and we'll have a south and southwest wind. It's going to be a breezy day with a strong southwest wind, so if you're headed toward Joplin or Kansas City or St. Louis, you'll get better gas mileage headed that direction. No rain, though, showing up in Oklahoma. Our weather will be dry through Wednesday. Here's your forecast for today. Sunshine and a high today of 70 with a north wind of 5 to 10 miles an hour. And you can see those cooler temperatures toward Grand Lake, Veneta, the Afton area with mid to upper 60s for highs. Bartlesville near 70, 70 Old Mulgee and 71 in McAllister. For tonight, we'll have another cool night and this will be the last of the series of cool nights. We'll see a low temperature tonight in the upper 40s in Tulsa. Mid 40s showing up outside of Tulsa. Bartlesville 45 and 46 toward Grove. Here is the seven day forecast beginning tomorrow. We return to the 80s. 83 tomorrow and 86 on Wednesday. Later in the week, we will see increasing rain chances toward Friday and Saturday. Obviously, the exact timing of the front will determine the rain chances, but right now, it looks like that Friday and Saturday will be the highest chances for rain. Last night, the Tulsa Pink Run was ongoing near o at the OU Schusterman Center, and this is to raise awareness for women and children who've suffered with cancer. And, of course, the point is to wear <laughs> pink and to celebrate. And these shorts here, which I actually wore those in public, I actually had that pair You're of... You're a brave man. <laughs> Those of you who went to high school in the 1980s remember when these were big time fashion. <laughs> and I've kept them all of these years. My wife never threw them away for whatever reason. And I wore them last night. I have to admit, I remember mm -hmm. having a pair of hot pink shorts <laughs> with frogs on them. So mm -hmm. I can't give you too hard of a time, George. And my pair of OP and my jam shorts from back in the day. <laughs> a nice look, for sure. Thank you, George. John